Now, Nairobi Hospital has been murdered by leadership wrangle since the ouster of Gordon Odundo as chief executive officer and overhaul of the board of the foremost private hospital in East Africa in May. The changes in top management has occasioned episodes of confrontations that have affected daily operations in the facility. Dr. Richard Barasa, the chair of the hospital's medical advisory committee, while addressing journalists today, said the leadership row will ultimately be decided in court, even as the hospital works on scaling down costs of treatment. We are reaching across the board to be able to offer surgical services, radiotherapy services, laboratory investigations and chemotherapy treatment at affordable costs. If someone was asking how long it would take, forget about the court cases. As doctors, we want this to be as soon as possible, not years to come. The day-to-day -day management of the hospital is under the administration headed by the CEO, who is currently an acting CEO. The CEO and his team oversee all regular activities of the hospital.